Scorpio, how are you? I hope this finds you well. So we are going to be doing your person on your mind reading, whoever you're thinking about. That is who this reading is intended for. And everything that you'll need to know, whether it's about this reading or scheduling your personal readings, all of that is in the description box below for you. Now I do have a special going on and tomorrow is the last day to get your orders in for it. It is a uh, recorded video reading for 2222, all about the person on your mind. And everything that you'll need to know is posted on the community page for you. Or my email is in the description box below. All right, my loves, we're going to be using the Oracle and the Tarot to take a look at the energy of the person on your mind and where their energy is towards you and where it looks like it could be heading. All right, Scorpio. The person on your mind, Scorpio. All right, we have cast a circle, raising vibrations. Raising vibrations. And at the bottom of the deck, you have Witch's Brew, Seek Alternative Solutions. So Seek Alternative Solutions and Raising Vibrations. Some of you guys could be dealing with somebody here and maybe things have been very tense or very difficult lately. We have avoiding. And I want to feel that way again. Yeah, I just feel that. I feel like things have maybe just not been the best. You guys could be trying to avoid each other or avoid a difficult conversation. Um, we have treating you right at the, bo at the, bottom, of the, uh, the bottom of the deck. So... I feel like there I feel like things were really like really positive between you at one time with this. I want to feel that way again. It's like how can we get back to this place? With that I see this shocking event here uh right underneath this. I see happy ending too. So there could have been some kind of argument or some kind of situation here that uh things quite haven't been the same since then. That's kind of what that's feeling. It's like well, ever since this happened, uh, ever since this argument or this conversation or ever since I said this, like things have not been the right same way between us. And I feel like you're trying to figure out how to get back. You could feel like somebody is kind of avoiding you or, you know, you guys are, you're trying to kind of tiptoe, trying to avoid, um, you know, another confrontation. Um, so let's, let's keep going. Let's see. After this raising the vibration, it's like trying to figure out, okay, well, how can we get back to a good place? Um, and with this seek alternative solutions, um, you know, I definitely feel like it's possible, especially with that happy endings card as well. So you just may have to kind of get out of the box thinking it and figure out how we can shift the focus from whatever happened, whatever that negativity is, towards something more positive. But we're going to take a look at their energy towards you. We have the Temperance, the Six of Wands, the Eight of Pentacles, the Three of Swords, the Seven of Wands, and the Page of Pentacles. We have the Ace of Wands here at the bottom of the deck. So I definitely feel like it's possible to get that spark back with that Ace of Wands showing up. Yep, it's, and look, right underneath that is a tower. So I definitely feel like there could have been some kind of tower here, some kind of argument. There's something here that happened. Um, but I definitely feel like with this Ace of Wands coming out right underneath it, it's possible to get the spark back. It's, it's definitely possible to come out of this energy. We even have the Five of Cups in the reverse um, right underneath that, right? So that's like a coming out of the energy. So I feel like if somebody has been feeling a little bit wounded or if I feel like with this Three of Swords is a challenge, somebody's feelings could have gotten hurt. Maybe both of you, maybe just, you know, something kind of um, maybe went a little bit too far, but I definitely feel like somebody's feelings have been hurt. Now, with this energy though, it looks to me like it's very possible to come out of that. They have the Temperance card here for their 
thoughts. So they could also be thinking about how to bring something back into balance or how to make peace in a situation, how to get past on it or how to get past it. I do feel like after whatever happened here, because I do feel like somebody's feelings did get hurt, I do feel like they have put a, like almost like put their guard up. And maybe it's not even conscious. Maybe it's just, you know, a like a reaction to it, okay? Like a trauma response almost. Um, where I feel like somebody could have, you know, put their, put a wall up or put their guard back up. And maybe that's where some of this weird energy is here between the two of you. Because I definitely feel like things have been off or things have been weird um, between the two of you here. But the six of wands in their heart space. So they, they want to get past this. And they definitely feel like you can. Um, it's like, I feel like they're just not quite sure how. Okay, they're not quite sure how to get past this with you, but they want to and they feel like it's possible, especially with the Ace of Wands and the Six of Wands here. That together makes a Seven of Wands. So somebody could be realizing that either you have put up a wall up, Scorpio to them, and they're trying to figure out how can I get Scorpio to let their wall back down, or they could have put their wall up uh, and they're you know, trying to figure out how to work through it and get past it. Their intention is the Eight of Pentacles. I feel like they still want to pour into this. I feel like they still feel like this is a connection that is worth putting time, effort, and energy into, and they want to. I feel like their intention is to continue to try. Um, potential outcome is the Page of Pentacles, which I can almost, I almost always see as good news. Um, so this could be like a positive conversation here. Even here, this person's like flipping a coin. It almost looks like they're getting ready to take a chance on something here. So whether this is like you know, you getting you putting your guard down again and, and taking a chance on this person or whether they are choosing to do that to you. I definitely feel like the spark is gonna come back. Okay, it looks like there's still potential for a really happy happy ending here. Um, I do feel like it's possible to get past whatever this issue is. So I feel like this could be a confirmation for some of you. If for those of you where you're the one that put up the wall, Scorpio. You know, I do feel like somebody did, they didn't want to hurt you here. And I feel like they are trying to kind of figure out how can I get past this with Scorpio. Um, and I do feel like they want to treat you right. I feel like they do have good intentions here. Um, so they could be trying to figure out what to do here, especially with this seeking alternative solutions. But the signs I'm seeing for you, I see all the fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I see uh, Virgo, Libra, and Capricorn, Taurus, Scorpio, Aries. So those are the signs I'm seeing, but it could be any. It is a general reading. And even if I did not mention a specific sign, this reading can definitely still resonate for you. But that is what I have for you. I do hope that this helps. Now, if it resonates, let me know. If it doesn't, that's okay. Just check out your other placements. If you want personal prayers for any reason, just put the little prayer emoji in the comments down below and I will go through and pray for you. Um, everything you need to know about the specials on the community page. And if this is where we part, thank you guys for being here and I will see you next time.